I have detailed timestamps on this morning's article. So um, this morning's live stream, so you can go there and watch that article about Rashid Bank. Guys, there's only good news today. And Alak is not back yet because he was in those meetings uh, Sunday and Monday and maybe even still today. But it also said CBI auctioned $5 billion in Forex during August. $5 billion they got rid of, right? They're de-dollarizing, guys. And they're working together with uh, to develop the Iraqi economy. The private banks support the central bank's reforms. The U.S. Treasury backs Iraq. Oh, that was the biggest news. The U.S. Treasury actually said they back Iraq's reforms. Hold on. Let me pull up that article. I did um, do that in detail this morning. But guys, U.S. Treasury backs, there's so many good news. What do you start with? It says, um, U.S. Deputy Treasury Secretary Wally Adameo reaffirmed support for the Central Bank of Iraq and Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al Sudani's reform agenda aimed at improving the country's economic landscape. al Sudani's. Uh, it says the meeting focused on discussing bilateral economic relations between the two countries, U.S. and Iraq.